Hey, good morning. Peace and blessings. Uh, I just want to continue on, you know, what I usually make my content about, you know, spiritual warfare. Um, this demonic programming, you know, the matrix, you know, that we're under, you know, this demonic spell of witchcraft um, seeks to promote, you know, sexual immorality, you know, is, is one of the main factors, you know, I've seen, you know, through my studies. Um, you know, sexual immorality is wrong, says in the Bible, you know, I'll leave it, you know, below in the description um, on this YouTube video, um, you know, also in the real um, for Instagram. But you have to realize, you know, uh, sex with men is an abomination. Um, this world promotes it. Um, women are genetically made, genetically engineered, you know, through DNA, through, you know, uh, creation from Yahweh God um, to, you know, be with one man. Um, when you are a woman and you lay with your more than one man, you, 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 you bond yourself to, to multiple men. You, you're creating demons. You're creating soul ties. Um, it is being promoted in this world prevalently um, because, you know, the Freemasons you know, who control this world you don't understand. You know, they, they want to and seek to destroy the souls and, and, and the gift of heaven of these young women, you know, in our community, in our societies. They understand it. That's why you see the Megan the Stallions, the Cardi B's, you know, the sexy reds, you know, the promiscuous women, you know, being promoted so heavily, you know, being, you know, you know, young women are very impressionable. You know, so if they see these young women, you know, as, 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 you know, cherished, you know, by society, you know, by this demonic world, you know, they're going to, they're going to flock to it. They're going to, they're going to, you know, run to it and, you know, like, like, like flies to, to, to ish. You, you get what I'm saying? It, it's just what it is. You know, young women are, are, are very, you know, by genetics, women are illogical. Women are delusional. Their whole life is based upon, you know another person's idea of happiness and they know, most likely don't realize what happiness is for their true selves until they're like 40. You know, so Satan likes to get them young. You know, personally, I've watched it play out, you know, many times, you know, in my community, even in my personal life. You know, I've watched young women, you know, throw their lives away, you know, create, you know, a, a, a legions of demons, you know, to their vessel, you know, through, you know, following, you know, their friends, following their, you know, their environment, following, you know, the social norms that are being pushed, the demonic social norms. This demonic programming that we're under, you know, me myself, you know, personally, you know, I, I've only lain with with five women, literally, and I'm 28. And I'm not ashamed to say that. Um, I think maybe that's why, you know, Yahweh chose me, you know, God, because He understood, you know, um, when 2020 came and the devil, you know, had his grasp on people's souls and 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 you know was able to, you know. These demons, these high-ranking demons and, 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 you know, normal demons, you know, disembodied spirits, you know, were able to, you know, lash themselves onto people's vessels, you know, through narcissism, become, you know, being an empty vessel. Um, you know, they realized, you know, God, excuse me, God realized that, you know, uh, you know, my soul is pretty clean. Um, you know, I didn't have any soul ties, you know, in 2020. You know, I lost my virginity after, um, really. Uh, so... I just think that's why God chose me, you know, amongst other things. My soul's pretty clean. I didn't have any soul ties, to be honest. You know, and I'm not ashamed to say I only live with five women. Um, you know, I think my wife would be pretty happy about that, to be honest. Um, uh, you know, I, I just, you know, when I was younger, I didn't realize, you know, laying with so many women, you know, creates demons for yourself. You know, men, men. You know, it's 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 it's, it's glamorized, it's it's commercialized, it's popularized for men to lay with like at least a hundred women. You know, by the time they hit twenty one, you know, but not understanding the spiritual parallel to that is, is you creating demons for yourself. You're adding soul ties to your soul. Man, yes, man is supposed to be with a woman, but a one woman. You're supposed to choose your one wife, your God God given wife, and marry her and be with her. Other than that, you're just you're just adding a collection of demons to your soul. Literally, and, and I see it played out in so many ways, men and women, personally. You know, I've seen it in my personal relationships. Uh, uh, females, you know, that I've dealt with that I already had a collection of demons, you know, that I came in contact with. And females that gained the collection of demons, you know, after, you know, I was with them. You know, I've seen it personally. And I understand it. You know, they change. They go through a metamorphosis, you know, when them, when them demons control the vessel. It's, you know, and, 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 you know, I've seen... You know, I've, I've, I've seen a lot. You know, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a spiritual warfare veteran. Um, but you just have to realize, you know, those things are, are, are heavily and popularly promoted because, you know, the devil, these Freemasons, these satanic people, um, these, these empty vessels, these NPCs, they wish for you to fall in love with the, the concept of going to hell. They're, they're trying to make hell popular. 
because you know most likely you know the older generations you know they already went through their you know gaining demons phase you know i've watched people in the society you know glamorize you know a woman you know a a, a, a gaining a legion of demons um you know like it was you know because you know people are narcissistic you know they want to destroy you know they they, they don't they don't want you to be better than them so so if a woman or a man you know, has a, has a cleaner spirit than you, has a cleaner soul. They're the light. Their their soul is a little lighter than yours. Um, you know, they're gonna they're gonna push you to do things to to darken your soul. And I've watched it play out personally, through many ways. You know, I've I've lain with women who already had a legion of demons, once I came in contact with them, and I've watched women who gained them after coming in contact with me. You know, through listening to people, through society, through demonic programming. A lot of variables. You know, this 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 is the demonic world we are in. Everything that is good is shown as evil. Everything that is evil is shown as good. There is nothing wrong with having one partner. You see the LBGGG community go to schools, you know, give 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 presentations. You you see kids at, at L parades. You 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 see you see women on TikTok and Instagram, you know, uh uh, uh you know, promoting their bare bodies. You know, at these parades, it's it's all foolishness. You know, America, especially America. And I got to speak for America because I'm American. I can't really speak for other countries, but I can only assume, you know, through Instagram, which I I use, you know, heavily. You know, uh, it's it's you know about the same. You know, just a little maybe a few cultural differences, but you know about the same. But America is just really, really, really just new Babylon, new Sodom and Gomorrah, new Babylon. That's what's being promoted. It is demonic. 2020 marked the end of times. Men are lying with men like it is old Rome, like it is old Greece. That is an abomination. The Lord did not create Adam and Steve. He created Adam and Eve. The Lord did not tell Eve to lie with 50 men, you know, then get married. He said, I'm bringing you two together. This is your rib. This is your helper. This is your partner. You know, not after 50,000 others, you know, since you were 16, you know, now you, you, you find you a husband. You know, that's not how it goes. So you have to, you have to, you have to realize this. Women, if you want to gain access to heaven, you have to abstain. Men, men as well, you have to abstain. You have to clean your soul. You have to shake those demons off your vessel. Sexual immorality is being pushed. Anything glamorized by Hollywood is demonic. Fame, riches, um, you know, a, a blaspheming God, sexual immorality. It's all demonic. You have to see this. You have to see the correlation. You have to see the spiritual parallel. Women love Instagram likes more than they love the concept of being a mother, of giving life, of, of, of being somebody's role model. They love Instagram heart likes more than that. In the Bible, it says in the end times, people will be lovers of themselves. People love Instagram likes more than being a mother, these women that are out here in this new generation. It is very sad. I've watched women destroy their souls for attention, not money, you know, not personal gain, you know, not, not a better lifestyle, not a change in lifestyle, you know, not a change of state, not a change of how you're living simply attention even if it is of a negative derogatory attention even if it's to the detriment of who you are as a person personally so i understand what's going on in this world it's very demonic so as a chosen one as a lover of god you have to choose your spouse well god will send you you know a spouse if that's what you 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 know you wish in your heart but you have to see the signs. You have to understand. These women out here, these harlots, these Jezebel-spirited women, they are not for us. They are for the world. You have to leave them alone. 
And I'm a vessel of God. I'm a man. I'm a flesh. I understand. You know, I lust for women still. You know, I just started having sex with women. You know, I lost my virginity at a very late age in life. So I understand it. I think that's why God put me through certain things so I can explain it. Yeah, I lust for women. But I understand also that I cannot just lie with any old Jezebel spirited, succubus spirited, um, harlot spirited woman out here because that is that is spiritual death. These women are spiritually dead. That are out here in this demonic program. They are spiritually dead. And the Bible says a woman's house is the pathway to hell. It is the truth. You have to be very careful with your association. You have to be very careful with who you link yourself spiritually with. Laying with a person sexually is, is a way to create life. It is precious. It is something that God cherishes because God created us. God loves humans. God loves you. But if you use your sexual energy, your God-given right to create life foolishly, you will gain demons. You will become an empty vessel for demons to jump in and out of, and you will gain yourself a golden ticket to hell. That is the rules. That is what it is. It is what it is. And you have to see it. You have to understand it. I understand it. I've been celibate. It's about to be a year after the winter is over. It's going to be a year. And it's hard sometimes, pause. It's difficult because I love women. You know, I'm not these, you know, these boffimated, you know, bisexual men. I actually like women. I'm not a man. I'm not a woman. Excuse me. I'm not a woman, you know, trapped in a man's body. I'm just a man. I'm, you know, I love women. Cherish women. I adore women. I want to lay with women, but I cannot lay with just any Jezebel-spirited, harlotted women out here because that is the way to hell. That's the pathway to hell. And as a man that has chosen that as a lover of God, you have to do the same. You have to understand the spiritual parallels we're going through. America, specifically America, this is new Babylon. This is new Sodom and Gomorrah. You got a kid's artist gyrating on the devil's penis for your kids to watch and view right before they go to school. You know, go get them a juice box, some crack, some graham crackers, and, 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 and go hear an LGB, you know, sponsor, you know, give a speech there and then come home to you with some horns. This is America. This is New Babylon. So you have to study the Bible and what it says about spiritual immorality. Sex with a man is abomination. Women having sex with multiple men is the pathway to them becoming empty demonic vessels. That's why it's being promoted. That's why you see Sexy Red, Megan Thee Stallion, Cardi B, Nicki Minaj. You know, those are only women heroes that these young women have, especially in the black community. That is their only heroes. That is their only examples of a strong woman because these Freemasons give them money. They make them demonic puppets and they push their sexual immorality BS to the masses. And so the cycle goes. Especially in the black community. These young, impressionable women have no heroes, have no role models. They seek to be free harlots, free whores, destroying their souls, laying with a thousand men by the time they are 20, and then telling a young man that, that, is, that is a good man, most likely, you know, that he needs to have a million dollars, you know, just to lay with them. And they're, you know, ran through, you know, graveyard of a vessel. It makes no sense. So if you are a male, even a female, and I don't want to be sexist, but I'm a male, so I speak for males sometimes, and I definitely want to speak for males in this video. But if you are a male, even a female, if you are chosen, you know, the light of this world, if you are a lover of God, Yahweh, if you are a lover and a practicer and a, and a bearer of Yeshua's Jesus Christ's cross, like I am daily, you have to practice sexual purity. 
abstain. God will see you bearing your cross and send you your spiritual spouse, whether it was male or female, whatever your sex is. But do not link yourself with these demonic vessels. This is the pathway to hell. In the Bible, it says the woman's house is the pathway to hell. And it says it for a reason. Because it is true. And cloak yourself with the armor of God. Become a prayer warrior. And bolster your prayer regimen. And do not fear these NPCs. You have dominion as chosen, especially as chosen. You have dominion over the demons in this, in this physical realm. Because they are not from here. You, this is your God-given right to be on this earth. The demons that link in these people's vessels by the thousands maybe, by the things and the way they carry their spiritual vessel, do not belong here. You belong here. So you have to take your power back. Stay close to God. Bear your cross daily. These are the end times. But there is nothing to fear but God. God is almighty. God is all powerful. And peace and blessings.